and welcome back to my channel if you are new here remember welcome to you and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for joining me once again welcome to this week's weekly vlog today is wednesday the 22nd of february if i'm not mistaken and obviously our vlog started today because <laughs> i just wanted it to start today <laughs> um yeah guys the fact that i'm actually even vlogging taking my time to vlog because i made a vow to you guys we'll do weekly vlogs all the way that's the only reason why I'm doing it, otherwise it'd be really busy, I'm overwhelmed, a lot of things are happening, I've got so much anxiety, like, you know, but as a child of God, I've got to cast my anxious thoughts unto the Lord and he'll pull through for me. So, um, yeah, welcome to this week's vlog. Um, today, as I said, it is Wednesday and I just came back from campus, it is about half past 5pm and yeah, I'm just about to relax, I've got an hour before I... Um, before I have home cell, like church home cell. So I'm just gonna use this time to relax, to chill, to unwind, because obviously I just came back from school and I just need to breathe. I need to breathe, you know? So I'm just gonna get myself a little snack and watch some Netflix and then just chill. Um, today, I had a meeting this morning. I didn't really vlog much of it. I just literally took one clip. I had a meeting this morning at Madame and Sir. I've got, like every Wednesday, I'm just doing a meeting because of something that I'm planning with my friend like we're in the pre-production phase of this big thing that I'm planning which you guys will know of very very soon okay. you know what 2023 like I actually think I take myself so lightly like I take myself so lightly but I've achieved so much already this year and I'm really proud of myself and I hope that I can share with you guys soon um soon enough um definitely will share with you guys but i really am a firm believer in don't talk until it's on paper okay until everything is chilled is is set you know so yeah that's the only reason why i don't really tell you guys stuff as they are happening but um as soon as everything is as soon as i get a heads up from my team i will definitely let you guys know what's going on <laughs> but jay we are working goodies this year anyway um yeah so i had a meeting this morning and then thereafter i had to go to campus because i also had a meeting on campus with my actors and yeah i was just i was just doing like some directing stuff you know so yeah and i was up all night last night creating a presentation like trying to create a presentation there was a plane outside so i'm so sorry if you guys can hear that but yeah like i personal life business everything is just a lot but i really trust in god because i really believe that to whom much is given, much is required. So, yeah, God must just help me because he knows my heart and he knows my intentions of my heart. So, I just leave all things to him, even though sometimes it's so hard to, like, not trust in God. I mean, it's so hard to trust in God, but I don't think I have a choice but to trust in God because he is the author and finisher of my faith, you know? And he knows the plans he has for me. And I just need to believe in that and just lean on him and not lean on my own understanding. So that's just what it is. <laughs> that's just what it is, child. Being a child of God is such a tricky thing, but it's amazing and it's a beautiful experience. But anyway, um, let me make something. I think I'm in a good mood, yeah? I'm actually in a very good mood. I'm in a good space, guys. Like, I'm, I'm in a good space. But anyway, I'm going to make myself something to eat. I'm actually looking at fruits right now. Probably going to get a banana and something. And maybe like potato chips. I don't know. I'll see. But um, I want to eat, watch some Netflix. And yeah, I'm probably going to talk to you guys again tomorrow. Because I don't see myself picking up this camera again today. Don't see myself doing that. But I just thought, let me just introduce the vlog. Or whatever. Her. <laughs> um, and yeah, we'll chat tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm not going to be on school the whole day. I've just got online classes. And I'm so happy because... Being on campus is, is a lot, but yeah, I've got online classes tomorrow, so we'll just figure out what we're doing tomorrow. I do want to go get some hygiene stuff, like I need to get my skincare stuff, because I'm running out of stuff, so maybe we'll do that tomorrow, uh, maybe, maybe. And then Friday, I've got campus, and then Saturday, I've got days with my best friend, of 
guys i've missed my best friend so much so i'm seeing her on saturday but we'll leave those things to when they come so yeah over manje i i'm just gonna chill and yeah but anyway please subscribe to my channel if you aren't subscribed because trust me my love you will love it here you will definitely love it here um so please make sure you do subscribe and also leave a huge thumbs up on my baby girls and leave a comment down below period because i like talking to you guys and y'all know y'all know i'll be answering my comments like i answer my comments because i love reading comments i just love reading what you guys have to say and listening or yeah i like reading what you guys have to say because I, I can't really hear y'all but yeah anyway um let's do this also i need to update my itinerary list i need to update i need to update a lot of things because everyone gets it it kind of land like home i was literally telling one of my friends this morning what's you know i'm finding it so hard to balance my stuff because obviously work is piling up it's piling up it's piling up um and i'm just struggling to like find a way to be able to do everything and she was like to me continue writing those lists that you always write like every morning wake up write a list write an itinerary of what you need to do what you need to accomplish on that day and I haven't been doing that because a lot has just been happening and I think I've just been so much in my head and yeah, but I just need to calm down. I think what I need to do is relax and calm down. I shouldn't be anxious, you know, I shouldn't be, it's not cute, like it's not giving, but whatever. <laughs> um, I've been rambling and I, 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 I'm talking too much. I don't know why I'm talking too much. I'm just happy, y'all. Like I'm in a good space. I don't even know, like my spirit is happy. I... I'm happy like I'm actually great regardless of the things that have been happening God is still good you know God is still good so yeah anyway I'm gonna shut up now and I'm gonna go and just relax and chill so I'll see you guys tomorrow love y'all So, I've been working all day, guys. I'm gonna I've been working all day. I've been doing schoolwork literally the entire day. I can't find scissors. Okay. My noodles are chicken flavored. Between all the flavors, my favorite is beef and chicken. I don't eat all those other flavors like Durban curry and cheese and I find them quite distasteful so yeah I always have chicken and the chicken or beef and that's just that so yeah guys I've been doing school work the entire entire day your action and Jay it's a lot I'm stressed stress levels are high but we can do it I'm gonna show you guys just now what I've been working on but I'm just about to take a snack which is my noodles before I make supper. So, before I make my supper, I'm just gonna eat my noodles. There's a quick little snacky. And yeah. Okay y'all, so this is a mood board for one of the scenes. Um, for one of the scenes that are in our script, yeah it's basically like a honeymoon suite and whatever and the reason why i'm even doing a mood board is because we don't have a production designer in our group in our team in my team there's no production designer there's no costume makeup and stylist so yeah we're doing it on our own like we're just tackling it like on our own so yeah i was in charge of this particular scene so this is a little mood board and yeah i think it's kind of cute yeah <laughs> now i'm just gonna write everything that i will need when whatever like the furniture what's going on in the scene and whatnot so yeah not done yet but yeah and i'm also watching netflix while i'm at it okay so i'm done with my first mood board both scene one and scene four and this is what it's looking like and then these are just all the particulars like what's going on in that scene and the setting and the atmosphere and like all the furniture that we'll need and the props as well um yeah i think i did a pretty good job i 
like this ring board. I like it. I like it. And then obviously there's my color palette over there in the corner. And yeah, child, that's just that. That's that. Now I'm gonna continue doing what, like what else I need to do. Okay, so now I've just received my, the second draft of the script. I'm hoping it's the last and final draft because I want to mark it up. Like I'm trying to do like a markup, a script markup slash breakdown type of thing. So yeah, y'all. Good Being a film student is not easy. Being a director is not easy. Ciao. Wow. So, um, today is Friday. The time is literally 8 p.m. I got home about 25 minutes ago. Um, yeah, just a little over 25 minutes ago. And yeah, today has been quite a hectic day for me because, like, I've been doing quite a lot. I was on campus um, from like 9 to, no, from 10. I was on campus from 10 a.m till like half past four no to like four yeah and then i left campus and i had a meeting with my partner my business partner um because we had to obviously we always having like meetings because I'm, I'm always telling you guys about this thing that we're doing so we had a meeting today as well um just to for progress um yeah and i'm tired like i'm genuinely so tired i feel like in every vlog i'm just complaining about how tired i am but i genuinely am tired and i don't want to complain a lot because like i'm not supposed to be complaining like in fact i'm supposed to be grateful for even having like these opportunities but sometimes it's just so hard when you just have so much like so much on your plate and so many things and so many people demanding things from you well not people really but like you the different areas of your life like school for example is demanding a lot from me um work is demanding a lot for me and having my own like thing that i'm doing it's also demanding a lot from me so i'm just like i'm struggling to like kind of like balance and like weigh things out properly and in a way that won't like make me feel overburdened but i trust in the lord honestly because like there's nothing i can do to whom much is given much is required there's definitely nothing i can do about it but to just trust in the lord and to just work diligently and with enthusiasm and all that i do because that is always my goal to just in every area of my life have the spread of excellence you know so yeah um i guess it's a good type of tide like it makes me feel fulfilled you know it makes me feel good even though like obviously being tired is not a nice feeling but it genuinely actually makes me feel good because i'm always like okay at least there's something that i'm busy with like at least i'm doing something for my future and for the betterment of my life but at the same time i'm just like will it pay off or well, all the hard work that i'm putting now all the effort that i'm putting now will it pay off because i feel like with so much going on like i'm unable to even like be present fully in vlogging for you guys and like you know because my day just goes like like kunink and minangi one like ngi one but i trust in the lord um yeah and all these amazing opportunities and things that are just happening and you know it's all god um and he's gonna carry me through it i definitely trust in that your eyes wow but yeah guys so today i was on campus I've got, i had a meeting in the morning first thing in the morning i had a meeting then i had tutorials and then i went to my meeting with my partner who's my friend <laughs> um yeah so that was basically my day it was a working day campus school and like personal work so 
yeah, that's been my entire week, actually. My entire week has just been school. And, you know, and then tomorrow, obviously, it's so a Saturday. It's my day to just do my own thing. So I'm going to be with my bestie. I'm so happy to be seeing my best friend, guys. Like, I feel like my best friend and I only see each other, like, literally twice a year. Like, we hardly see each other. But she's, like, my bestie. And we just hardly see each other. How 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 is that so? Like, do you guys ever notice that the people who are, like, the closest to you, like, your best friends, you see them the least. You see them the least. I don't know how it works, but yeah, we're seeing each other tomorrow. We're gonna go on a cute little girls day, whatever. So I'm gonna take you guys with me, of course. But um, yeah. Anyway, I'm rambling now, so I'm just gonna unwind. Obviously, maybe do some skincare, and yeah, just call it a night. Like just unwind i just need my mind to stop thinking like i need my mind to shut down and stop thinking about work and whatever but i can't do that because there's so much work i need to do there's so much work i need to do like i feel like my mind would think but god help me god help, god help me so yeah, right now i'm just gonna because i just got home i'm just gonna chill spend some time with myself um and yeah watch some netflix of course and just yeah that's that's what i'm gonna do just do nothing and then i'll see later on obviously there's a lot of work there's a lot like demand from me so i can't just be on netflix the whole time um yeah anyway i'm gonna see you guys i'm gonna see you guys so maybe i should do a little like some self-care maybe i should do some self-care yeah i'm gonna do some self-care later not now so i'm gonna see you guys when it's self-care time which will probably be like two seconds because like Obviously, the vlog. <laughs> hey, my loves. So today is a Saturday. It is Saturday. Um, I'm supposed to be sleeping right now. The time is seven thirty-eight. I'm supposed to be sleeping, you know, getting my beauty sleep, obviously getting ready because I told you guys I'm going to be seeing my best friend today, but I don't think that's going to happen because I was woken up at 6 a.m. this morning and I was told that I need to take these kids to school. So right now I am at Car Road, Hillcrest, and yeah, my little sister has a tournament today and yeah, so I had to take her and I have to wait for her until she's done and I don't know when that's going to be. Um, so I doubt I'm gonna see my best friend. Like, chances are I'm not gonna see her. So, right now, I just dropped her off. I'm gonna go and catch some breakfast because I'm hungry. I'm gonna go get some breakfast, um, at least quarter. Uh, probably go to like Woolworths Cafe or something or Oscars. No, Oscars food is horrible. I don't like it personally. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna go to Woolworths Cafe and just sit. Is, 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 is Woolworths Cafe that's next to Woolworths? I think it's Woolworths Cafe yeah and just chill and i brought my laptop and whatever so i can just get some work done while i'm there so i'm basically spending my day this side and that's just that like i can't believe like i literally when i was walking up i was just like guys i can't believe i've actually become like a mother to my siblings because ciao but i mean i guess i'm getting like prepped for when i have children one day you know this is how life is going to be. Like, this is how life is going to be. But anyway, I'm going now and... Let me put on my piece. I'm going, guys. Your shim Sana. I'm hungry. I didn't eat supper last night. Like, the last thing I ate was... Was wings when I was at Madam Like, three wings, which you mean. So, Gilambil. So I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna work and yeah, I asked my friend, I sent my friend a message you know, like when I was still at home to come join me um for breakfast. So I'm not sure if she's replied because yeah, I haven't really checked my phone. So I'm gonna see when I get to the restaurant. Um yeah, I asked her to join me, to come join me because like imagine now I'm sitting alone and <laughs> it's fine though, let's go. Let us actually go. Um, yeah, I'm gonna see you guys. Thank the Lord. Anyway, Cham, what has become of my life? Like, what has my life become? I do not believe this, Cham. 
I guess it's being a big sister and having to take on like so many responsibilities. And it's part of growing up, guys. It's, it's literally just adulting. It's adulting and I just have to accept it. I have to get to a point where I just accept it, you know, because I can things against it. It's not like I can run away from it. I can't. I cannot run away from it. And it's even worse when you're like the older sibling, you know. You don't get to bigger win. You don't get to bigger win. Hey! Go see him. But we don't I'm going to say this again. To whom much is given, much is required. So, Lord, you know my heart. You know my heart. And actually, this is actually the Lord's doing. Because I was going to spend my own money when I was going, like, when, if, like if I were to go out with my best friend, I was going to be spending my own money. And I'm supposed to be saving. You know? And I'm supposed to be saving. So I guess it's just God. It's it's honestly the, the hand of the Lord. <laughs> it's the hand of the Lord. Uh yeah. Anyway, so I'ma see you guys. I'm driving, so I'll listen to my music. I'm gonna see you guys. Once I get to where I'm going, it's actually like five minutes away from here, so I just got here, so I'm gonna go inside. And see, let's see, what's the vibe? <laughs> let's go, let's go. Okay guys, I'm home now. I've been home for less than an hour. Um, the time. It's hot post, hot post three right now. Anyway, I wanna show you guys what I got from Clicks. I'm gonna do a little Clicks haul. Um, not a lot of items literally, but they costed an arm and a leg. And I'm just like, they costed 645 rand. 6.45 for these few items I'm about to show you guys. Yes, I'm going to see. But all like clicks. But you know what? They can take my coins. Like, honestly, they can take my coins because 
I just love buying cosmetics. I love buying skincare. I just, I just love spending time at clicks. Like I literally could spend 30 minutes just walking around seeing what I want and you know, it's just nice. It's therapeutic. It's just something therapeutic about it. But anyway, the first thing I got was my CeraVe. This time around I bought the hydrating cleanser. I've been using the foaming cleanser, but I just wanted to try out the hydrating cleanser because I've never tried the hydrating cleanser before. So I'm excited to use it, start using it. So I got that, topped up on that. Um, I got my rose water, ABC Pay the other one that I had. So I'm very happy that I finally bought some more. I should have bought like three of these because I be spraying this like it's no one's business. Like, yeah, but anyway. And then I got some new foundation. My Revlon one had run out and I thought, let me try something new. Siri, Siri, uh, Siri. I thought, let me try something new. So I got the Revlon, I mean, I got the Wet n Wild foundation in the shade Espresso. And yeah, I used to use Wet n Wild. Okay, not that I used to use it, but I've used it before. So it's nothing new. Then I got some blush as well from Wet n Wild. This is a cute pink. This is a pearl, pearlescent pink. It's really cute. I really like it. I've never used this specific blush before. The blush I use is from MAC, y'all know. But I saw this and I was like, hmm, it looks good. I hope the pigment is good as well. Then I bought this for the very first time. All About Matte, the Essence Translucent Fixing Powder. I don't know what to expect, obviously, but I got it. And I'm gonna try it out when I wear makeup again, whenever that will be. <laughs> Probably very far from now, but yeah. I don't know what you mean by, and I'm going to try it out. Siri, I, I, I'm bizarre. Then the last thing I got was my, not my, the Essence lip gloss. I got more lip gloss, cause I mean, as a girl, you can never have enough lip gloss, honestly. If I could have 10,000 lip glosses, I would. Um, but yeah, I just got more lip gloss because I just wanted to get more, more lip gloss. And that's it. And all of these items, one, two, three, four, five, six items. Six items, guys. Costed 654 rand. But I'm not mad. I mean, they can take my coins. I'm not mad, but I'm just like... This is why I need to be making racks and racks and racks of money, honestly. But yeah, anyway, I'm back home now. And while I was at Wilbert's Cafe, while I was at the cafe having breakfast, I literally like almost broke down. Like I had a mini breakdown actually, like tears were about to fall down because I was just thinking about how I've been complaining so much about being tired i think footy that was actually god like i've been complaining so much about being tired and i just had a moment where i was just like i'm actually so blessed like when i look at my life and how it is even though some situations are not really ideal for me but the gist of it like my life i've got a really good life like i actually live a really good life and it can only be the hand of god it can only be god's blessings and i almost literally broke down in public thinking about that like i've just been complaining and complaining and complaining that i've forgotten to actually look at the good side of it i've forgotten to actually look at the blessings that god is actually pouring into my life you know so i just had a moment and i was like yo i love my lord i love my jesus i love god and i can only I don't know like thinking about my future scares me it really scares me because it's like i know it's gonna be bigger and greater than what my life is now and that scares me because i'm like my life is really good right now imagine in the future like five years from now but you never know honestly life but and jay i'm looking at it from a positive perspective obviously it's like I've made the most of what I have now and yeah I'm 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 actually blessed I'm actually blessed so I think I'm just learning to appreciate things and like stop complaining because complaining isn't godly firstly it's not godly 
um, I should just relax and breathe and take everything in and actually appreciate and see the beauty of things and the beauty of life really you know so it's a learning process a learning curve but yeah um i don't know i'm blessed anyway my loves i'm ending with the vlog now it is time for me to start editing because this vlog needs to be up tomorrow obviously because tomorrow is sunday um so yeah i'm gonna start editing the vlog and try upload it and yeah i'm gonna see you guys very soon in my next vlog i love you guys so 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 much please leave a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe period <laughs> period <laughs> Period. Period. P to the R. P to the E to the R I O G. Period. Thank you guys. I love you. And God bless. Mwah. I need to get a new bonnet, y'all. <laughs>